millions of fossils around the world could provide insights into plant evolution, but until now, many of them have been unidentifiable. In a major research breakthrough, Peter Wolf, professor of geosciences at Penn State and an international team, developed software that combines machine learning and computer vision to automatically classify leaf images into families. There's so much data encrypted in fossil leaves, and there are so many fossil leaves. Every time I go out and swing my pickaxe, just about, I find two or three new kinds of fossil leaves. Uh, fossil leaves, and even and modern ones as well, represent a, a huge underused resource in, in evolutionary botany. To categorize plants, botanists rely on fruits, seeds, and flowers but these are much less common as fossils than leaves. Leaves are difficult to identify because they come in a dizzying array of shapes and sizes. Leaf edges and vein patterns are complex and understanding this complexity is one of the most challenging problems in botany. So if you look at a well-preserved fossil leaf or a modern leaf, um, you will see thousands of veins in each one. It takes you like two hours to describe a leaf even after you're trained. Wilf looked outside of the field of botany to human cognitive neuroscience to solve this problem. About nine years ago, Wilf read an article by Tomas Sayre about a computer vision program that could determine whether or not an animal was in a photograph. So I thought, animal, not animal, what about you know this kind of leaf or that kind of leaf? So I cold called him and I said, look, we've had this problem for you know, well over 100 years. Would you like to help with this? And fortunately, he said yes. The method showed promise right off the bat. Wilf, Sayre, and their collaborators then spent nine years building and refining a computer vision program where the computer actually teaches itself botany by analyzing features of known leaves. The software Wilf's team developed is able to classify leaves into leaf families with a 72% accuracy. 15 times better than chance. This is machine learning where uh, the machine teaches itself everything. To teach the computer to learn, the researchers input a database of 7,500 known leaf images. The computer uses this leaf database to automatically create its own dictionary of important classifying features that correspond to leaf characteristics, such as vein patterns. The computer also produces a heat map showing the areas of the leaf important for correct identification. The heat map reveals a lot more information than the human eye can discern, and it's also much faster. You see a dark red square on the, on the leaf in one of our heat maps. It means that little tiny piece of the leaf helped the machine decide that this leaf belonged to the right family and not the wrong family. There, there's been this whole encoded universe of tiny little leaf futures that clearly means a lot and we've never been able to access that. Um, and, and now we have with these heat maps, we have a visual guidebook of where we should be looking. The path is now open to identifying plant fossils in museums around the world, and Wolf hopes to create a more accurate picture of plant evolution. As the team pursues that long-term goal, Wolf also hopes that this breakthrough can benefit other scientific disciplines. I feel like not just that we've hit the tip of the iceberg of new information, but that we've discovered icebergs.